Today, I'm introducing a new shader tutorial series on advanced materials. Let's go. Most modern game engines, including Unreal and Unity, use a physically based lighting model. That means that the math used for creating the lighting tries to approximate the actual behavior of light. What this means for artists is that when we create materials, we have a specific set of inputs that we use most of the time. These include color, normal, smoothness or roughness, metallic, ambient occlusion, and specular or reflectance. With this basic set of properties, we can represent most of the materials in the world, like wood, metal, plastic, rubber, and others. In a previous video, I went over each of these basic material properties in detail and covered all the guidelines for creating color, normal, roughness, metallic, and ambient occlusion. So please go back and watch that video if you haven't already, so you'll understand those properties really well. I'll put a link up here in the corner and down in the description. Even though these properties allow us to create a huge set of materials, they don't cover everything. There are a lot of materials that can't be created with just color, normal, roughness, metallic, AO, specular, and so on. So today, I'm starting a new series of tutorial videos dedicated to advanced materials. What do I mean by advanced materials? Well, I'm talking about materials that require subsurface scattering, anisotropic specular, clear coat finishes, retro reflections, iridescence, and more. We're going to cover snow, ice, rocks, brushed metal, car paint, carbon fiber, cloth, skin, glass, and the list just goes on and on and on. And like we always do, we'll be creating these materials in both Unreal and Unity. If you have ideas for materials that fit into this category, please let me know. I'm putting together a list of topics to cover right now, so post a comment down below for materials that you'd like to see. Buckle up, because we're about to take this channel from Shader Graph Basics to Advanced Materials. Come back next week and we'll jump right into it.